Hi everyone, welcome to MSCR Makes. I'm Miss Julia and today I have a special project for you. I'm working in collaboration with my friend Miss Melissa from over at Virtual Outdoor Club to bring you this project. We're going to be working together to show you how to make your very own set of toilet paper tube binoculars and a fun activity that you can get outside and do with them. I'll show you in this video how to make your very own toilet paper tube binoculars. Tomorrow, Miss Melissa will have a video showing you a fun outside activity that you can do using the toilet paper tube binoculars you've made today. For this project, you will need two toilet paper tubes. If you don't have two toilet paper tubes, you could also take a paper towel tube and cut it in half or I'll show you how to make some tubes using just some paper and some tape. The other things you'll need for this project are some markers or other things like stickers that you could use to decorate your binoculars, some string or yarn for hanging your binoculars around your neck, and either a hole punch, a stapler, or some tape so that you can attach your string or yarn to your binoculars. You'll also want a pair of scissors. You can pause the video here and go gather your supplies. Now that you've had a chance to gather your supplies, I'm going to move some things out of the way. First, I'm going to show you how to use a piece of paper if you don't have toilet paper tubes or a paper towel tube to use for your binoculars. The first thing I'll do is take my piece of paper and fold it in half. Then I'll grab my scissors, unfold my piece of paper, and cut on my fold line so that I have two equal or the same size pieces. Now that I have two pieces, I'll grab some tape and I'm going to roll each of my pieces into a tube. I want to make sure the tube is big enough that I can see out of it. Once I'm happy with the size, I'll grab my tape and put a piece on my tube roll so that it stays in place. I'll do the same thing with my other piece of paper. I want to look at them and make sure that they're about the same size. I'll grab another piece of tape and secure this roll too. This is a great substitute if you don't have any toilet paper tube rolls on hand. I'll show you the rest of the project using these toilet paper tube rolls that I have, but remember you can still use your rolled paper or a paper towel tube cut in half as well. The first thing I'm going to do is attach my two toilet paper tube rolls together. I can do this either using some tape or a stapler. I'll show you using the stapler. I'll hold my two toilet paper tube rolls together and put my stapler in between them and do a staple. You might want to have your grown-up help you with this step. Now that I have a staple in there, I'm going to flip it over to the other side where I do not have a staple and do the same thing. Now, my toilet paper tube rolls are stuck together. Next is one of my favorite parts. I'm going to use my markers and decorate my toilet paper tube roll. I think I'm going to decorate it with some things that I hope to see outside. What are some things that you might want to see outside with your toilet paper tube roll binoculars?
I think one of the things that I would like to see is a bird. So I'll draw a little bird on here too. Once I'm happy with all of the decorations I want to put on my toilet paper tube binoculars, I can move on to the next step. I'm going to just do a few drawings so that you can cover your whole set of binoculars with all sorts of fun things. The next step is making the string so that your binoculars can hang from around your neck so that they're easily accessible while you're out doing your activity. I'm going to take my yarn and get about an arm's length of yarn. Use my scissors and cut off my piece. Then I'll show you both ways you can attach the yarn. The first is just to use some tape. Take a small piece of tape and tape it on the outside. You can also use a hole punch if you have it. Punch a small hole near one side of your binoculars. Then you can thread or put your yarn through the hole and make a few knots. If you have trouble making the knots, you can have your grown up help you. Another way you can do it is using your stapler. If you use the stapler method, make sure that the top part of the stapler is on the outside of your toilet paper tube roll. This way, the flat part of the staple will be on the outside and the two crimped edges or the folded over ones will be on the inside. The folded over edges can be kind of pokey if you're not careful, so it's better to have them on the inside and not on the outside where you can touch them. So for this one, I'll put my string down and then making sure that my stapler is the top part on the outside. I'll go in a little ways, making sure that my yarn is caught in between the two sides of the staple and staple down. Now my yarn is stapled to the outside of my binocular and the crimped or folded over edges are on the inside. Well, I hope you'd enjoy making your toilet paper tube binoculars, and I hope you enjoy watching Miss Melissa's video tomorrow and going on a really cool activity to use your toilet paper tube binoculars. I'll see you in the next one. Bye!